Today, I will be walking you through how we can leverage the predictive capabilities of Einstein Discovery in Salesforce and how we can connect that resource to a dashboard in Tableau. We will use a custom Tableau extension to make dynamic real-time predictions based on a user input. And first, I wanted to give you a little bit of background for our scenario. Uh, I will be acting as a human resources manager for a company that has been dealing with employee churn. And keeping turnover low is pretty important uh, because according to a study by the Center for American Progress, turnover costs can be anywhere from 10 to 30% of the replaced employee's salary. This includes time spent on screening and interviewing candidates, training a temporary replacement and lost industry knowledge. And we will say that before we implemented this tool, that we have some kind of insight into what makes an employee stay, but not a ton. We have information like commute distance, salary, benefits, as well as survey scores on coworker relationships and employee satisfaction, among others. Normally to do this kind of analysis, you might hire a data science team or a skilled analyst, but with Einstein Discovery and Tableau, the power is in your hands. Let's jump in. So we'll see here that we have a dashboard built around some employee attrition predictions. All the predictions were done in Einstein Discovery. And all we've done here is connect them to this dashboard here. And But we can actually take this a step further. I'm going to isolate just the custom component. So on the left, we have a employee number and the probability that they're going to leave the company. These probabilities range from zero to one. And let's say we know employee 913 just had a bit of a role change uh, and we know he's going to travel frequently instead of travel rarely. So what we can do is we can get a prediction and we'll see down here that his probability to leave the company is now very high. Uh, and this is not good. We want to keep this employee. Obviously, if we're promoting him, we're giving him more responsibilities. We want to keep him. So we can try a couple different things. Let's start with the stock option. Let's bump them up to one and we'll get prediction. Okay. And we can see that we're still at 52%, which is much better, but it's still not where we want to be. So let's turn that back to zero and let's say, okay, maybe he's traveling frequently. Maybe he doesn't want overtime anymore. So let's turn that off and we'll get this prediction again. There we go. This is much better. So now as an HR manager, I can have an informed conversation with this employee before it becomes a problem for him and offer him things that will make him stay and decrease employee turnover in the long run. 